everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Belinda Yan, and I just want to start off with let's just talk about the elephant in the room. So, my hair is obviously a different color. Um, I am now a blonde. Oh my god! Wow! After some home dyeing incidents. This is not really the color that I wanted it to end up as, but my hair just couldn't handle any more dyeing for the time being. And I still gotta make videos for you guys. I still gotta push it out every week. So here I am showing you guys oh, no, no, what no, it looks no. like right now. It's more of like a dark. It's more of like a medium blonde. It was supposed to be like a light to medium ash blonde. Um, and then I was going to put a light ash brown. The only thing was I couldn't do the second step. I couldn't put the light ash brown in because my, my scalp could not handle it. I'm gonna talk about another video and I'm gonna put it all together so um, more to come on that but as of for right now this is sort of like a strawberry blonde I feel like my hair didn't lift enough so then there were some copper tones and then I tried to put a blonde over it and it just didn't really work out the way I wanted it to but anyways I am going to fix it in time I just ordered like a bunch of stuff and I wanted to show you guys I don't really know when I'm going to be doing this um, because I kind of want to let my scalp heal for a little bit longer. It's just, it's going to take some time. I also have really dark hair and yeah. I'm not a professional. They say don't do this at home, but here I am. Um, this is what I'm going to do. I have more 30 volume developer and 20 volume developer um, I also got ion color corrector um, this is in case I want to just remove all of this color and then start over let's see what else did I get I got a bunch of products to help keep my hair healthy during the dyeing process um, and then for colors, I really don't like this blonde on me. Um, it looks a lot better, I think, in camera than in person, and especially in the sunlight. I don't like the way it looks on my skin. I don't like the way that I kind of have an ombre, but it's light to dark instead of, like, dark to light. <laughs> uh, yeah, something obviously went wrong. So I'm going to put, I'm either going to remove the color or I'm going to put like a darker color over it. Um, just because my hair is so dark it didn't really lift after a few sessions of bleaching. Um, probably didn't do it right. I definitely didn't do something right. But I have light ash brown, light golden brown, medium golden brown, and another medium golden brown. Um, just because these are like darker colors that I could put over this to fix it. I, right now it's kind of low risk for me because I don't really have to see anyone except for my work Zoom meetings. But honestly, if you like change, adjust the lighting a little bit, um, it looks okay on camera. And Zoom is kind of like a little bit blurry, so it's like perfect. Um, so, for, so for the products that I got to keep my hair healthy, um, I got like the ion booster set so these are like the booster step one booster step two and then I have booster step three that I previously have um, and I also got Olaplex this is like super recommended everyone says to use this um, it's supposed to repair and strengthen your hair kind of from the inside and then I also got um, the Ar a few of the Ardell red gold color corrector packets. Um, these are to tone the orangeness, the brassiness in your hair. These are only like a dollar each. 
99 cents. So yeah. And that's all I have in the box. Like I said, I don't know when I'm going to be doing this yet. Hopefully I don't have to see anyone for a while. I don't have to do anything. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this is what I look like for now. Surprise! And I know I've been doing workout videos every other week, but this week I just felt like I couldn't do that because... I've been studying really hard and I wanted to spend more time studying and for workout videos I feel like they just take a really long time because there's a lot of different parts that goes into it. Finding the right music takes so much time um, and just like putting together all the little pieces. <laughs> Anyways, um, stay tuned. I will definitely make a vi another update video later on to kind of showcase the whole entire process. To get to this stage right now, it took me two weeks because I did a uh, first bleaching session and then I did like another bleaching session with color and then we're gonna do another color session later. But right now my scalp is still super super sensitive um, so I'll probably be laying off the chemicals unfortunately for a little bit. Also. Just, can we just check out this uh, really awesome leopard print Snuggie? <laughs> I've never had a Snuggie before, but I got this as a gift last Christmas. And I didn't open it until recently while I was, you know, working from home. And it's been like the best thing ever. Who doesn't love animal print? And... <laughs> It's just so cool! <laughs> Isn't this awesome? I honestly just work like this sometimes. Bruh. Oh my god. <laughs> I just discovered there are pockets for your hands. That is amazing. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And please let me know what else you'd like to see. And I'll see you guys next week.